Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and today we're going to be making showing you how to build a better detective from the fifth collectible minifigure series so here is the minifigure itself so of course I'm going to be taking a different approach this time instead of showing you the completed figure at the beginning and explaining which parts I used I'm going to be showing you the completed figure in a minute and then showing you going to show you a before and after. Yes. So. Let's take a look at the figure. It's a pretty nice Deerstalker hat. Pretty good printed face. Sideburns and everything. Nice printing on the torso. No back printing, unfortunately. And no printing on the legs. Because that was not very common back then. I don't know. And of course he has a magnifying glass to sniff out clues. So now let's modify him. Be back in a minute. And here he is. Sorry about that. Now here is a finished minifigure. He has the Brick Boys hairpiece from the minifigure series 18. And a race car driver head from the same series. Of course the same torso. But the legs. I've swapped them out with the animal catcher's legs and they have a nice smart look to them which is why I chose them and I've also fitted him with a custom pipe which is made with a screwdriver and lever head of course I left him the magnifying glass because how is he going to solve mysteries without a magnifying glass I think this minifigure looks really good and as an added bonus I have built a classic John Watson minifigure with a standard brown male hairpiece a mustache Face, Professor Flitwick's torso, a small stick for a cane, and a revolver. So, I hope you enjoyed this little tutorial, and I will see you guys later. Goodbye.